Hey guys, so now we're going to unbox this EP Ever Pure Sine Wave Inverter. So as I said, in a, which is going to be used um, with uh, lithium batteries and a Victron um, charge charger. So let's see what you get in the box. Um, on the outside of the box is just some writing about Pure Sine Wave. This is a Pure Sine Wave Inverter. This is all the detail of the inverter, if you want to know, it's 400 watts um, output power. Um, it's actually a 500 watt inverter, but I uh, see it says 400 watt here. Let's quickly see um, the IP500 what you get in the box. So you get a little booklet, shows you everything about all the different sizes of inverters you get from EP Ever and uh, yeah everything i think everything you need to know of how to install the batteries and connect stuff to this uh, turning it on and off and, and whatever you need to know inside of the um uh, or the inverter it's got two dip switches i see there this is the 200, uh, 230 220 volt version uh, you also get this one but this one is uh, is here um it's got the 60 and 50 hertz setting also uh, this inverter let's quickly just get the inverter out of the box and see what what we uh, have over there very sturdy packaging nice thick plastic uh, this is just some kind of a certificate quality check All right, so there you go. This is how the inverter looks. It says the EV, uh, EP Ever 500 watt pure sine wave inverter IP500. So it does say 500 watts over here, but you'll see now uh, the 400 watts. This is input of DC 21.6 to 32 volts. This is the 24 volt version. It's got a nice big fan over here. And these nice screws uh, of thumb screws so it's easy to just put your cables on and tighten this with your cables in there it's got two fuses over here I believe it might be for the positive and negative uh, but both of these fuses are 24 or 25 amps 25 amp rated so both of them are 25 amps and um, on the side you've got this heat sink this is uh, the whole body is part of the cooling and on the back of the inverter there's no communication port on these only a USB I believe that's for charging there's the little dip switches that I spoke about on an off button and your power out so that'll be your power in and that'll be your power out on the inverter. This is, you will be able to screw this down into a surface and uh, install it like, like whatever orientation you, you would want. It's no, no issue if you put it like that. Uh, it's just, um, just a little convection thing. Uh, there's the back of the inverter. Also very sturdy and whatever. Uh, there you can see 400 watts so output power 400 watt I don't know if it can take a spike up to 500 watt but apparently it's 400 watt we'll test that I've got a 500 watt lamp which I can put on here and uh, then we can we can maybe see how that how this fares in, in, in pulling that lamp so that's the EP ever 500 watt the IP500 unboxed and just to show you how it looks. So thanks for watching. 